What is up, everybody? Captain Ujack here, and I went to Walmart this weekend, and I'm I'm I know I'm not the only one having this problem, but there's people just buying up all the Pokemon product, and there's nothing. There hadn't been anything for a little while, and uh, I have other interests that I that I enjoy other than just Pokemon. For instance, I like wrestling, as you can tell by the shirts, and that championship right there. I can't break. Yeah, but anyway, um. So I've decided I'd pick up this uh, 2020 Tops Chrome box, WWE box, and uh, we'll just uh, do a little unboxing of this. All right, and uh, I've never opened these cards, any of the boxes of these cards, so I have no idea what I'm looking for or anything like that. Um, I just figured it'd be fun, be fun to open them up and see. So it comes with, it said seven, seven packs. Uh, all of them have four cards in each, and then it comes with three uh, chrome, tops chrome packs, three trading cards in this. Now, I'm assuming these are all going to be ref refractors, so I'll save that for last. We'll open that at the end, and uh, we'll just start off opening up these packs here. All of them got Becky Lynch on the front. We got, oh, we got, we got a shot. oh god, it's a little more shiny than I thought. I don't like how they're, they're bent. I don't like that at all. But, uh, yeah, we got a, a shiny little big show here. Well, little big show. We got a shiny big show. Uh, we got a Buddy Murphy. Oh, he just goes by Murphy now, but, yeah. Carmella. We like Carmella around here. Let's, let's make sure that gets good and focused in. I know Cody will like that. He's the one that wanted me to open this box on camera. Uh, and we got uh, Angelo Dawkins. One half of the Street Profits. Yeah, I, I, I don't like the way these cards have been kind of folded in that box. And like you can see, you can see the pack itself is bent. I can promise you this is probably the last time I buy these particular cards. I don't like that at all. Alright, next pack. We got a, got a Sonya Deville. Oh, this is one of the, is that an NXT, NXT UK guy? I guess. Bronson Reed. I don't watch much in XT UK. Can't even read that on the camera. Oh, it's Johnny Gargano. Couldn't tell what it was. There we go. And Leo Rush. Leo Rush. Ah, you turned that upside down. Leo Rush card there. It's not bad. Alright. That's two packs down. Again, every pack like that. It's not good quality. Not good quality. It's already ooh, I can see the back. I normal like this. One. Got a Damian Priest. Focus. There we go. We got a the big dog Roman Reigns. Oh, a fantasy match card. The Diamond Cutter versus the RKO. Uh, DDP. Uh, I'm an old head, so uh, being a growing up in the South in the '90s, late '90s, I was a WCW guy. Used to love DDP, and we got Tony Storm. I keep turning the wrong way. Got a Tony Storm card there. All right, move on to the next pack. I hope the are the refractor cards. Okay, they don't they don't seem to be as bent. So, if there is any value in here, that's where it is. Move in here. Oh, my least favorite women's wrestler. Oh, there we go. We'll get to that. Got this Travis Banks guy. I don't really know who he is. We got uh, the highlight of the wrestle the the Royal Rumble every year, Kofi Kingston. Oh. Humberto Carrillo, that's not, uh, that's better, not really, oh well, and then we got a Charlotte Flair, I'll probably be throwing that one in the trash, no I'm not going to throw it in the trash, but she is over overbooked, and she it soured on me last year when they uh, put her over Rhea Ripley, and two years ago, 
when they inserted her in the Becky Lynch Ronda Rousey feud. Yeah, too much Charlotte. Uh, we got a uh, any TV uh, TNA guys. Uh, we got a rock star Spud Drake Maverick. Yeah, the Beast Incarnate Brock Lesnar. It's all right. There we go. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we got a legend card. We got Christian Cage. There we go. And is that Jimmy Uso? Jay Uso? It's Jay Uso. He looks so much alike. Yeah, that Christian card. I hope it's not bent too bad. Uh, see, eh, that's shoddy. Well, it's not as bad as some of them. But I like that Christian card. Alright, we got two more packs here before we get to the, the main event. All right, and Oscar. Try to get that glare off. These cards are so shiny. It's a shame they're they're all bent. Oscar, Kane. We got a Kane there. Oh, a Kevin Nash. Shocking wins. Oh my God. Uh, I remember the night. <laughs> The night he uh, he ended Goldberg's streak, him and Scott Hall hit uh, Goldberg with the cattle prod. He was posing as security. But, uh, I was a big NWF fan, but Goldberg, everybody liked Goldberg back then. If you were a WCW fan, I'll sit there with Christian. And then we got a Naomi was the last one. Focus, there we go. All right, last pack before we get into the refractor pack. Hope you see some good stuff. I know, uh, I know my buddy Cody. He uh, he went on eBay and he bid and won a Boogeyman Green Refractor earlier today. Oh, I can tell him I like this one by the last card. We'll get to that though. Uh, Miz, the Miz here. I keep turning wrong. Got Bobby Fish, uh, one member of the Undisputed Era. Oh, Kyle, <laughs> Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly back to back. That's pretty sick. Yep. And Rusev or uh, Miro, the best man now in AEW. All right. Now let's see here. This this tops Chrome refractor pack here. It's only three cards in this one. Oh. All right. Oh, a guy from not far away from me here. They got we got Braun Strowman, a fellow North Carolina native. Oh, King King Corbin. I was a I was a fan of his until the whole King gimmick and well before that the he just he's been wasted I think all of his gimmicks. He's got two of the the best signature move. And finisher combo in wrestling, and they just waste them with terrible gimmicks. And oh, Doc Gallows, Luke Gallows, uh, current Impact Tag Team Champion. It's been popping up on AEW with Machine Gun Carl Anderson. Well, I would say I got that box for twenty bucks. I mean, it's kind of cool. I, d I do like the, I do like the Nash card. And the, the Christian card. Those are probably my two favorites. And it was cool seeing the, the DDP and Randy Orton card. That fantasy booking card. But uh, I'm just hoping, fingers crossed, the Walmart can start back having some more Pokemon cards. And people can kind of chill out on buying those uh, buying the shelves off of those. But anyway, that, that I don't think that box really is worth 20 bucks. Uh, you can let me know what you think down in the comments. Uh, make sure to leave a like, sub, do all that good stuff. And uh, I'll catch you back next time whenever I come up with some idea, you know. <laughs> but uh, have a good night.